What is going on with Olivia Wilde? First off, let me say I love Olivia Wilde. I love her movies. I think she's a great director. I think she's a phenomenal actress. So naturally, I have been following this story like no other. So as you probably know, every celebrity in the world right now is at the Venice Film Festival in Italy, promoting their new films, attending the premieres of new films. And so naturally, Olivia Wilde, who is the director of the new film starring Harry Styles and Florence Pugh called Don't Worry Darling, is there promoting and answering questions on panels for the new film. From a business perspective, I think it's totally all press is good press. I mean, this controversy, regardless of whether it's staged, whether it's real, I mean, people are definitely going to go see this film now. Like, everybody's talking about this film. Everybody's curious what's going on with this film. But I want to d- deep dive into, like, what's going on. So now the main conflict is, are Florence Pugh and Olivia Wilde, like, no longer friends? Because it kind of seems like they might not be. And it all sort of started when Shia LaBeouf was fired to create a safe, more, you know, safe environment on set because he was facing allegations from FKA Twigs, which I think are totally true, by the way. He was literally in a radio interview the other day saying that, like, yeah, I did those things. Like, of course he should be fired. Like, this guy abused FKA Twigs. What's going on? But thankfully, our friends at The Independent have, you know, broken it down from the very beginning to now. So let's go from the very beginning. So it all starts in July 2019. The film is announced. Wilde is confirmed to be directing the film. It's a story conceived by Carrie and Shan Van Dyke. It's also suggested that Wilde was going to star in the project. Then early 2020, Olivia Wilde splits from her long-term partner, um, who is, you know, Jason Sudeikis, famous for Ted Lasso, among like many, many, many other projects. But right now he is like a global superstar for Ted Lasso. They have two kids together. People are feeling sad about the split from um, Jason Sudeikis, but they're excited that she's going to be, you know, directing and starring in a new project. And Florence Pugh goes on Instagram and is like, oh my gosh, Olivia Wilde is literally my idol. I mean, who wouldn't say that Olivia Wilde is an idol? She's like a fascinating, fabulous, incredible person. Then September 2020, Shia LaBeouf departs the project and Harry Styles joins. This is when things start to get dramatic. September 2020, FK Twigs, who's a world famous musician who, you know, is an absolute icon of an artist. And she's also dated some really high profile people like Robert Pattinson, Shia LaBeouf, et cetera, et cetera. She files a lawsuit against Shia LaBeouf. Um, and you can re- pause and read right here about the, the claims. I'm totally on FK Twigs' side on this. So at the time, Shia was already apparently like clashing with his castmates, having some poor behavior on set and was like gonna leave the film. Then things started to really get interesting because Olivia Wilde is spotted with, you know, her employee. (laughs) I never know how to feel about like on-set relationships because I know they're so normal, but it's like, she's technically his boss, but it's Harry Styles. I mean, like, girl, I would too. And they're spotted holding hands. Okay, I'm running out of time, so I'm going to do a part two.